Let's have a look at their buyers. Okay, so we started at day nine. It's good to live under a, a roof, if a leaky one. I apologize for my ty t tirade, but please understand. I was planning to walk out on the street in broad daylight and wait for the bullet, but I had what? Had I been alone a day longer? After all that I saw, I'm just tired of trying to stay alive. Unless we get some bandages, Pavlin will die. We can't let that happen. We need him. Zlatan must have really been desperate to rob that hospital. It's more unfortunate that Zlatan got herself killed. Getting get food, food is our priority. We must preserve. Uh, Pavlin will probably die of, of those wounds. We should give him a proper burial when he does. There were times I would have condemned Zlatan from the hospital. Zlatan didn't make it back last night. I'd cry. But I have no more tears left. Oh shit, wait. Oh yeah. Uh, my friends are very hungry. Getting food for them should be my priority. I gotta be strong. My friends have it rough as well, but it hurts so much. It was Latter who robbed the hospital, but somehow I still feel responsible. I wish I could help my friends. They look so hungry. Women from our street look gr took great care to look beautiful. They were always clean, wearing their best clothes, des desperate the terrible conditions. We tried so hard, but it was all in vain. Only kids still have had some hope left. You know what my boy did? What? I wish I could help Veta. She looks so hungry. Someone killed that last night. We should avenge her. How the fuck are you going to avenge when you fucking lethally wounded? Oh, we have the f fuck! I forgot. We can't do anything. What can we do? This is so bad. Can we give her bandages or some medicine? I don't... I don't even know. I... I don't even know what to say anymore. I don't have fuck all. What do we need? Food. I think I could offer, offer those two, maybe? That's very generous. Fuck. 
Let's do that. I'll hope for that. We got medication. Oh, we got bandages and food. She's not very hungry, so she's fine. Oh my god. This is so fucking depressing. Oh my god. She's gonna fucking die. Due to recent sh uh, shortages, the prices of cigarettes and tobacco have become exceedingly high. Many people need cigarettes to calm down, but how can they be calm look knowing how how much they must pay? The rebel and government forces are engaged in violent skirmishes throughout the city. Some areas have been completely cut off, while others witness heavy fighting. We just sold all of our herbs, so we can't make anything, can we? We can make roll-up cigarettes. Fuck me. <laughs> I should have ran while I had. While I had stuff, I should have ran. Fuck! Can't we give him food? Oh, here we go. Yeah, we've got two bits of food. Anton's hungry as well, so Anton's gonna have a little little bit to eat as well. Then we'll go and talk to um, Veta. You go to sleep. Why does he have to be lethally wounded? I, w I would I want to take him to the hospital so that they can treat him, but he's so wounded that he can't even go. That's how fucking severe his injuries are. Oh, I know. Fuck! Should have ran. Should have ran. Should have fucking ran. How is Anton not tired? He's been really, like tending to everyone all day. Especially since Latter's gone. Oh, time's gonna run out. God dang! I don't know. What we can do anymore. <laughs> Half of it is a ruin, but there are people living in that. Another half, apparently, they aren't hostile and have a lot of stuff to 
bots, even food and medicine room, to take some trade if we go to pay them a visit. Super is looking at a uh, raining area on the minute, but people are still trying to scavenge it for some can expect to be able to scavenge there, so it's probably best not to go in there where some doors might be still be locked. So we need food. It's a mass market. Fuck it. And so the other man. <gasps> Hello. Oh, my God, thank you. Thanks so much, dude. Oh, I'm so happy these guys are friendly. Oh, wait, did I not take everything? Oh, it only sucks that it's answer with the least amount of inventory space. Oh shit. Anything good here? I wonder... I can see them like scavenging, scavenging through shit like here. I wonder if that means that like some stuff actually gets like... Um, Looted since they're looting as well. That'd be kind of a cool mechanic, so you kind of have to like it's kind of a race as well, trying to get to the um, scavenging points quicker than they can. That's cool if, if that actually is what happens. Can't confirm though. Let's, let's try to hurry then. Oh shit. How can we get downstairs? Oh, here. Oh, does the other guy go downstairs already? I think he might have. Fuck. I think he actually does. Like, stuff gets looted. Oh, he did. Check here. Oh, have they already checked? What do we need? I don't even know what we can, what we should take. There's such little. <sighs> Aha, there should be good stuff here. Secret room. Oh, uh, well. Not really. Or maybe this one? Uh, no, no. No. Fuck. Wait. Oh, it's locked. Oh, shit! Okay, okay. Oh, the cigarette might be good to have.
Get rid of the water. <laughs> we just try and come back here. There's a lot of stuff here which we can dig, but we just can't because I have no materials. Or not enough. There's this whole room up here, uh, on the side here as well, which I haven't checked. Nah. Are they leaving? Where are you going, guys? Looks like they're leaving. Hello? Oh, they left. Okay. <laughs> At least we can count the good people this time. Might even be bad people next time. A faded leaflet with the skull and crossbones read Danger! Do not touch unexploded ammunition. Any weapons, ammunition, or equipment left behind or unexploded may be booby trapped. Do not touch anything. Do not risk severe in wait. Do not risk severe injury or death. Report. Any such finds to the nearest army outpost. Okay. Have I checked this one yet? think so. Let's uh, break down this door as well. Can we check the whole place now? We check this, right? Yeah. I think that's everything. Oh shit, yeah. Okay, let's go back. Okay, that wasn't bad. Just lucky that, like, um, the scavenging group there were good people. Because I think the last time I went, there was bad people, and I think I died as well. So, yeah.